A very warm welcome to you. Many thanks for joining us on this edition of Almond Finance and Wealth Reports, your source for latest happenings in the financial services sector of the economy. I am Jennifer Obidiebubi. On this edition of the program, we take a breather from our usual lineup to bring you highlights of two major events. First off, we bring you highlights of the Insurance Industry Consultative Council IICC 2016 Media Retreat in Abelkuta, and then highlights of the Association of Registered Insurance Agents of Nigeria, Arian, 2016 Insurance Walk. The insurance work saw agents and participating companies walk the length and breadth of Ikeja, creating awareness of the importance of insurance, especially in the time of recession. All these and more are what we have on the lineup this week, so sit back and spend this time with us. Details coming up in just a moment. Please stay with us. Insurance protects your business. Take advantage of cargo, haul, liability, freight, and other marine insurance policies for the maritime sector. Are you an owner of private or commercial vehicles? It is compulsory that you take the minimum insurance to protect other road users and their properties. Fire insurance policy is compulsory for all owners of schools, hospitals, hotels, malls and other public buildings. The Insurance Act of 2003 mandates you to take fire insurance policies. Be on the right side of the law. Protect your businesses and assets. Visit any insurance broker or company today to get the right policy for you and your business. This message is from the Nigerian Insurance Association, NIA. The Insurance Industry Consultative Council, IICC, is made up of various constituent bodies in the industry, namely the Nigerian Insurance Association, NIA, Nigerian Council of Registered Insurance Brokers, NCRIB, and Institute of Loss Adjusters, Island. The Consultative Council recently invited media men to the Dakar Hotel at Biokuta for two days for the 2016 media retreats. The annual media retreats was initiated to provide a platform for knowledge sharing for better reporting. Welcoming participants to the retreats, the chairman of the IICC, Lady Isioma Chukuma, president, Chartered Insurance Institute of Nigeria, said that the insurance industry recognizes the key role of the media in propagating the industry. The industry recognizes the role of the media in projecting its ideals and has continually engaged the media in propagating same. I must appreciate the important role the press is playing in making sure that insurance forms part and parcel of our national consciousness. Retreats from time past have deliberately highlighted topics designed to focus on effective reporting of insurance by the media. Other topics discussed in the past included compulsory group life insurance, which provided room for fruitful discussion as we were able to exchange views with practitioners on their application in practice. This year, we are focusing on the main theme reaching the unreached, the media as partners in insurance development, with the hope of providing a platform for better awareness and penetration. I have no doubt that you are familiar with these issues, but it is my belief that the interactive sessions will be rewarding. The media has always been perceived as stakeholders in all its ramifications. Therefore, your contributions to nation will be emphasized. Delivering the theme paper, Reaching the Unreached, the media as partners in insurance development, Mr. Ndubuisi Ubede, former editor, Daily Times of Nigeria, said 
that insurance operators must come out to show that they can be trusted so that reporters can help create the needed awareness. Insurance must come out seriously to show that they can be trusted. One of the tenets of insurance is that it must be delivered in good faith. Agreement must be in what? In good faith. So if it's not in good faith, then it's not good at all. So you must deliver. And having been able to deliver, we too can help by using uh, borrowing from uh, the marketing world, using the marketing mix. The marketing mix contains four P's, although the fifth P is there. The four P's are the product, the product must be good, the pricing, the premium that has to be paid in case of uh, uh, the insurance world must be correct. Then there must be promotion. Promotion is the media. And then there must be the last one, the place. That is the organization, the standard organization that has a reputation, that has good image, that will be able to provide all of this. Delivering the second paper, an overview of agricultural insurance business in Nigeria, Mr. B.K. Martins, General Manager, Nigerian Agricultural Insurance Corporation, NAIC, said that agriculture can meet 70% of our employment needs as a country. If we look at agriculture, agric is not just growing crop. If you see agric as a business, it is not just growing crop, it is not just raising livestock. It is all the activities that makes agriculture. And we will later get to the value chain in agriculture. And if you look at this value chain, we will appreciate when it is said many times that agri itself is capable of creating 70% of our employment needs. Because it starts from research to what we need, the seeds, all the inputs into farming, all the farming activities, all the post-farming, post-harvest activities, up to the kitchen, all for exports, like the former Minister of Agri would say, from farm to the mount. If we consider all the processes involved, we will agree that it is capable of generating that mass employment that we so desire. The planning committee of the 2016 IICC media retreat also brought a financial expert to talk about financial planning. Mr. Kenneth Dohuje, managing director, Money Talks Resources, told journalists that the ability to earn without going to work again is the ultimate financial freedom. The ability to earn without going to work again, that to me is the ultimate financially. I don't need to show up when money enters my account because I've built what? A system that makes it possible. And financial planning is the foundation of that system because you need to plan. But it's not impossible. You can get there and you will get there. So financial freedom, passive income, making money when you're not working is fantastic. I love it. I love to be there without stressing myself and making money. Savings, what's your net worth? And I want to talk a bit about net worth. Your net worth is your assets, what you own, less your liabilities, what you owe. That is what you use to measure if a person is rich. Your net worth. What do you, what do you want to be worth in 10 years? Five years from now? 2021, what do you want to be worth? Do you know you can write it down and walk towards it? Do you know? You can. Success starts by planning. So, what tools can you use to plan? There are many tools you can use, and I just listed some. Because we're talking about proper financial planning. I talk about spreadsheets. You can use Microsoft Excel. You can use their budgeting apps and software. A budget, remember, shows you where your money is going. You need to know where your money is going to be able to plan to control your money. You can use budgeting apps. In America, they have what is called financial calculators. You can put in 
how much you earn now, put in the rate of inflation, put in the rate of interest, and project that in 25 years, my 10 million era now will be worth how many million? Those are what is called financial calculators. You can go online. You can find them. As expected, the media retreats provided a platform for insurance correspondents to ask questions and express their concern about the insurance industry. I want to actually know how we can handle this issue of perception. Perception. Yeah, I, uh, most especially as it concerns insurance. Because I've had an issue like when I was in the print media, one of my editors had uh, on several occasions accused me when I write some reports. When I write the premium, maybe when I write an insurance company pays this type of premium, when the article goes to him, when I say an insurance, when insurance, maybe declare their premium. No, when they declare their premium, the premium that they got, say, yeah. He will ask me, say, ah, you are writing this insurance people, they are declaring that they made this as their gross uh, a profit or gross earnings. Are they paying claims? Then when I now write that they paid claims, he said, look at the small amount that they are paying upon all the money that they are getting as premium. You know, issue of precision. How can this actually be so? Even when you like, we reporters now, we try to reach out to the public, say, okay, insurance are paying claims. So I don't mind them. Who are they paying to? And even when the uh, some people say they are not making, they are not actually doing well. From the serious business of paper presentations, participants at the retreat this year went on a tour of the famous Olumu Rock in Abiyokuta. The yearly media retreats for insurance correspondence by the IICC has remained a platform for reassessing relationships with each other and in the process exploring new ways for forging stronger bonds of cooperation and collaboration between members of the press and the constituent bodies in the insurance industry that make up the IICC. Insurance protects your business. Take advantage of cargo, hull, liability, freight, and other marine insurance policies for the maritime sector. Are you an owner of private or commercial vehicles? It is compulsory that you take the minimum insurance to protect other road users and their properties. Fire insurance policy is compulsory for all owners of schools, hospitals, hotels, malls, and other public buildings. The Insurance Act of 2003 mandates you to take fire insurance policies. Be on the right side of the law. Protect your businesses and assets. Visit any insurance broker or company today to get the right policy for you and your business. This message is from the Nigerian Insurance Association, NIA. The Association of Registered Insurance Agents of Nigeria, ARIA, plays a significant role 
in the insurance industry. This is because as sales intermediaries, insurance agents interface with the insuring public on a regular basis. Given the low awareness and poor perception that has plagued the insurance industry for so long, Arian recently decided to lend their voice in creating the needed awareness about the usefulness of insurance, especially at this time by organizing its 2016 insurance walk. The insurance walk kicked off from the Lagos State Secretariat, Alausa Ikeja. Speaking briefly before the commencement of the walk, the Director General of the Nigerian Insurance Association, Mr. O.S. Thomas, said that it is at the time of recession that insurance is most important. This work that we're having today, like I said, the second of the edition, is meant to enhance the quality of the service that we render to the public. The Association of Registered Insurance Agents is a formidable arm of the insurance sector. They have the largest of population and without the agents, the insurance sector cannot move anywhere. The industry right now, we are moving towards promoting individual participation and enlisting as clients to the various companies within the industry. It's important for us more than ever before. In time of recession, that is when insurance becomes most important as a financial intermediation instrument. And that is what we are trying to tell the public. I'm sure as we proceed on this work, we will make our products available to the public. We are going to tell them about what we stand for. We are going to tell them of the values in our products. And I believe beyond the bottom line that we will experience a positive increase in our bottom line individual companies. I believe that the insurance sector, its contribution to the GDP is going to be greatly enhanced. Let us take this work very serious and we believe that our companies will not regret for being part of what we are doing today. Also speaking briefly, the president of Arian, Mr. Olamiron Badebo, implored the agents to educate people about insurance as they participate in the work. Today we want to make sure that everybody in Lagos State understands the importance of insurance. Don't be true. We want to celebrate our governor for telling that he is our number one insurance man. Don't be true. So the insurance agent is saying very soon, if anything matters, it's going to be the insurance industry. Don't be true. As the worker they go, please help as many people that are not informed about the relevance of insurance. Help them, inform them, give them the knowledge required on top party insurance and all other relevant insurance policies that you have with you. And more importantly, for those policies that we'll find on the road that are fake, we will tell them because we're just at an advocacy road now. We're not going to do anything for them. We don't want them to know that if you want the right insurance, where should they go to? The work ended at the Ikeja bus stop. Participating companies this year were Mutual Benefit Assurance, Lasako Assurance PLC, Leadway Assurance, Sovereign Trust Insurance PLC, Aiko Insurance PLC, Niger Insurance, and Standard Alliance Insurance. The Association of Registered Insurance Agents of Nigeria no doubt has made progress in their roles as foot soldiers in the insurance industry despite 
the ever-increasing challenging operating environment. <laughs> Insurance protects your business. Take advantage of cargo, haul, liability, freight, and other marine insurance policies for the maritime sector. Are you an owner of private or commercial vehicles? It is compulsory that you take the minimum insurance to protect other road users and their properties. Fire insurance policy is compulsory for all owners of schools, hospitals, hotels, malls, and other public buildings. The Insurance Act of 2003 mandates you to take fire insurance policies. Be on the right side of the law. Protect your businesses and assets. Visit any insurance broker or company today to get the right policy for you and your business. This message is from the Nigerian Insurers Association, NIA. And that's our time on the program this week. I do hope it was well worth your time. Do join us again next week for a fresh new package. In the meantime, do feel free to contact us on 017763981 or 080-335-7879 or 090-9685-2685. Or you can send us an email on almond4x at yahoo.com or almondproduction at gmail.com. Do visit our website, almondreports.com. Like our Facebook page, Almond Finance and Wealth Reports. And subscribe to our YouTube channel, Almond Reports TV, to view past episodes of this program. Do remember to join us every Wednesday by 9.45 a.m. live on Niger FM 102.7 for our Pigeon English program, Waiting Insurance, they do self. We are also available on WhatsApp on 080-335-7879 and you can follow us on Twitter at Madam Insurance. This program also airs on BCOS television every Thursday by 6 p.m. for those in Ibado and environs. Until we come your way next time, I am Jennifer Obidiobubi and many thanks for watching.